Hello, oh everyone, Glorian set of Ragtag Sagvi here, and welcome to the next episode. In the last episode, we arrived at Motorstroke and started exploring a fair bit of it. Now let's head to the Pokemon on gym to join the league, the join the gym challenge. But first, there's a few things I need to note. Off screen, I did some more raid battles and whatnot to gain some uh, material, to gain more items. And I just so happened to join a random raid and got myself our next team member. That team member is an Applin, but it's no ordinary Applin, as you can see, it's shiny! Yes! I was able to find a shiny Applin through a random raid! I just have that my Wicon arm as I was talking to trainers and whatnot to get items. I noticed it appear on my Wicon, join it! Shiny. So yeah, we're gonna be having uh, Applin join the team. It was I was debating over three grass type lines for this game, and Applin was one of them. And I thought, oh, maybe I could use Applin, but it's a bit hard to find. Not to mention, it's a bit tough to raise. But when I got the shiny, I think that the get I think the Cosmos was telling me, yes, use Applin for your Shield team. So we're gonna be using Applin. So it's decent um, attack and special attack, uh, which is surprising. Although I think it does focuses on defenses, it senses stats when it evolves in shield. Only moves it has is astonish and withdrawal, so it's a little difficult to use. It's probably not going to be seeing much action until it evolves. But anyway. We have Applin, so let's give him, give, uh, is it a he or her? I never, didn't look at the gender. Ooh, it's female. All right, let's give her a name. So the name I want to give it um, I originally was going to use this name as a joke, but given that it's shiny, I think this name is a little bit more fitting. Let's call it... Yoshi! So we got, so Yoshi's joined the team. Ooh, wait, 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 go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. I just realized this has been about two or so days since my last recording. Let's just quickly hit this up. Check on the poke jobs. New jobs are available. I'm probably going to send Pokemon off to them um, off screen. Welcome back, guys! Do your Pokémon do gain experience points for doing jobs? The amount they gain depends on how long you send them out for. And Wulu gave us a heal ball. Has impressed your clients so there's more jobs available for you from now on. Yes, yeah, so I'll probably do the job thing uh, off screen. I'm curious if uh, Violet and Scarlet's gonna have something similar to that, because I do like the idea of, like, here's something your Pokemon in your box can do. Rather than sit around and do nothing all day, they can actually do stuff for you. But now it's time to head for the gym itself. There's the Pokemon Gym. The studio can even handle Dynamax Pokemon battling inside. It's said that long, long ago, there was a giant stadium made entirely out of stone. Uh, if you try to go over here, there will be a Corviknight blocking your way. Corviknight is a Pokemon that flies about, uh, all, flies all about carrying people wherever they want to go. But even they get tuckered out. This 
stadium's so huge! I wonder how many houses would fit inside. Ta-da! You took the time to talk to a Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. Pokeball. In case you're wondering, I'm not just any old Pokeball. But then who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. And I got sucked into Hop. You made it too. Motorstruck Stadium is where the opening of the ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world. It's getting me a bit nervous, really. Nah, this isn't isn't just nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. Come on, Donnie. It's time to show the world. Oh, it's time and the world learn our names. Everyone is participating in the gym challenge. Just welcome to stay at the Dew Drop In. We League staff are here to provide support for various matches that occur throughout the gym challenge. Here we can see the symbols of the gyms. And we'll just quickly go grab this item. Free burn heals. Would you take a look at this? This place is packed with gym challengers. Every one of these folks is another rival. Let's get signed up. Seriously, what a piece of work. If you're here to register for the gym challenge, I'll need to see your endorsement, please. Fancy that! This is the first time we've ever had a challenger endorsed by the champion. Well, now you had two, because I am as well. What? Two of you at once? I wonder what ought to come over Leon this year. The two of you must be something, something special. On Hop! On Leon's little brother, in fact. And the next champion. Give me all sign up, would you? Well, yes, I'm trying to, if you just give me a moment. There, you two have been successfully registered as gym challengers. You can now choose your preferred number for your uniform, if you would be so kind. It will be displayed on the back of the uniform. You must wear it for any official match. So now we can choose whatever number we want. I'm gonna stick with the number I had previously, which is Evie's, which, um, double checking my notes, should be Evie's national Pokedex number. One free free. Number one free free, is it? Very well. And here, please wear this challenge band at all times to identify yourself as a gym challenger. The opening, the, 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 the opening ceremony for the gym challenge is to be held here tomorrow. All the trainers taking part have been booked a room over the nearby uh, Badoo drop-in. That's the as the league chairman for you. Even booked us all hotel rooms. I'm off to check it out. The fancy digs. Head towards Route 3. I'm sorry, but only challengers can take on the gym mission and go beyond this point. The ultimate ceremony of the gym challenge. My whole family will be watching back home. I should go and check my hair once more in the mirror, don't you think? I heard that this year's gym challenge includes trainers that were endorsed by the chairman and even the champion. Okay. Oh, how did I did his voice? <laughs> I'm trying to remember. 
I was endorsed by the chairman himself. In other words, among all the elite eat enough to get an endorsement, I'm the most elite of all. So why don't you clear off and try I not talking to me again, would you? It's possibly criminal of you, wasting the time of someone as important as I am. I think I had his voice something like that. <laughs> I may change his voice every now and then because of that. I'm trying to remember how I did his voice. Let's all, all do our utmost as gym challengers. You're looking a bit gobsmacked by all this. You must be from a small country town, is that it? I'm quite the same myself. Perhaps there are heaps of us starting out like this, but only a small number will make it to the end. So everyone here is a fellow gym challenger. I'm dead nervous, and this is the only, and this is only the old, old bleh, 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 opening ceremony. What's the matter with me? My Pokemon all seem to be itching to battle, so why can't I feel the same? All rested, so let's go to that inn. You must be Challenger Dottie. The Badoo Drop Inn is down this way, if you'd be so kind as to follow me. Head to the Badoo Drop Inn. Ah, Motorstroke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony is held. Expedition matches are super exciting, too. The gym leaders show up for the gym challenge opening ceremony. Do, 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 do. Challenger Donnie, we have arrived at the Badoo Drop Inn. Try to get some rest and build your strength for what's to come. My favorite person is the champion. My favorite word is strongest. Most of those the companies here in Galar are owned by Chairman Rose. Let's go in and rest up. Hiya! Looks like looks like the boat oh of got yourselves registered. Oh hey Sonya, what you doing at our, at our hotel? I'm researching the mysterious Pokemon that is said to be in the in the slumbering weald. I reckon if I look into some Galar legends, I might I'd figure something out. Care to join me? You are are here already, anyway. What's this then? It is a statue of the hero who once saved the Galar region. I could run through the legend. The legend. Uh, right quick if you fancy Give us all the details Long ago a great black storm covered the Galar region people called it the darkest day The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero But they bearing a sword and shield the statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. We still don't understand what kind of sword and shield the hero actually had. And what was this black storm that's supposedly to be just another misery? A mystery? <laughs> misery, yes! Another misery for the world. <clears throat> Whatever it was, it blotted out the skies all across Galar. I suppose that tracks with it, it being cold, the darkest day, but still. Huh, I suppose that hero must have been, must have been a, as about as strong as Lee then. Looks like you, are you going to have your hands full with plenty of research though, Sonya. Black storms and swords and shields and all. You'll be alright, Sonya. <laughs> Thanks. I muddle through somehow, don't you worry. You two are staying here at the hotel tonight, though, aren't you? Shouldn't you check in? Probably so. 
And we'll look out for you. You too, Sonya. If we hear anything about any hero or whatnot, we'll tell you. Guess we probably should head to the front desk and check in. Thanks for always tagging along with Hop. I hope you can keep it up. Leon actually... Leon really worries about him too. He's practically raised him after all. It's a statue of the hero said to have saved the Galar region. Well, something's happening here. What's the problem with those guys? I can't check in. What's the deal with Team Yell? I can't check in. Well, before we deal with that, let's go upstairs and take a look at the upstairs portion of the hotel. They came to watch the matches at Motorstroke Stadium. When they're really good, you can hear the cheers all the way over here at the hotel. When you watch a match at the stadium, you can feel the vibrations coming right up through your feet and echoing all throughout your body. Like nothing in this room. I know there's a few items that can be found here. I noticed something shiny on the ground while I was wandering the wild areas, and so I went to investigate, and guess what I found? A star pieces! A whole bunch of them! Here, you can have one too. Yay, free money! You can sell star pieces at a, for a good price at the Pokemon Marts. I got my eye on some new clothes and, and a new hat already. Let's go check this room. That, that's a Dynamax van! Having a Pokemon turn gigantic in a stadium sure is intense, right? The wishing star on your Dynamax van. I hope your wish comes true. Alright, nothing else in this room. One final room to check out. Leon is the best, and his Charizard pose is the best too. I will have to agree with that. You got an adorable Pam Cham. That grandson of mine doesn't know what he's talking about. When it comes to do the Charizard pose, there's no way Leon could ever outshine me. Alright, we've done checking up up here. Now let's go, oh, and uh, try to check in. We're gonna have to deal with these guys, though. Let's see, um... Yeah, so 41 and Yoshi's ready. These Pokemon are temporary, mainly to give me some coverage if things go wrong. But yeah, let's, uh, let's deal with them. Uh, what would be a good voice for these guys? I'm trying to remember. We came all the way... No, that's way too deep. Um, we came all... No. I want to do like so, like a British Cockney voice, but I keep doing like a gruff voice. <laughs> uh, we came all the way out to this big city so we could probably cheer on the gym in challenges. Team Yell is here to help after all. You're in for a battle if you want to stop us. I'm up for that. Need to really practice the, uh, British voice. Need to be tell you, mate. Okay, that sounds a bit more British. You get in our way, and you're in for a battle. Team Yell's all about helping. Helping one very special trainer win the gym challenge, that is. We want to make sure she gets cheered on nice and proper. And you're gonna help us make some noise. Here we go, our first battle with Team Yell. Sitting out one of my favorite Pokemon, Zigzagoon. Let's give that Ziggy some water. Also, I love that uh, Drizzle um, throws like water bombs when he uses water moves. I really love that. And you're looking for a fight and I lost. I'm so pathetic.
Oi! Give me a break here. Team Yell, get revenge for me, would ya? Of course I got you covered, mate. What could be better than a battle in a, in a lovely hotel lobby? Challenge by Team Yell Grunt. Let's bring out Nikki. Who's also adorable and another one of my favorites. Oh, and the TV needs a bit of a clean. Anyway, let's give it a water pulse. And down goes her nicket. I must have gotten out a bit carried away. Being in this swanky hotel and all. Sorry for getting you away. Ah oh, man, this swanky ass of... Funerocrastic air in here had me off my game. I couldn't keep my cool. I wasn't expecting checking in would be, would be eh, such a big fuss, Donnie. What's going on? Sneaking in some Pokemon battles without me? Don't you think you can get a, uh, get ahead of me that easily? I need to get some training in, so I'm joining. Here, I'll even heal up your Pokemon too. On hop. I'm one of this year's gym challengers, and I'm the one who's gonna be the next champion. Now let's us have a nice ice two on two. I can really hear my victory coming. And the only sound uh, I've lost that voice. The only sound you'll be making is a whimper. A uh, defeat. Time for two on time for a double battle. Alright, so Hop sent out Wooloo. Uh yeah, let's target the Nicket. Go 41! Forty one grew to level eighteen. Our special attacks have fell. That's actually kind of bad for forty one. But he should still be high enough level that that zigzag gun should go down in one hit to a waterfalls. I'll be surprised if it survives it. There we go. Feed Team Yell. My voice is unsure when I'm sad. I want to yell, but I'm unsure. I came to see the gym challenge opening in ceremony, but this is awful. Guess it was defeat I hear I hear, I heard coming. I'm thinking about to cry. What are you lot doing here? Marlini? N nothing. We were just... I know you're all terribly curious about the other gym challengers. But you gotta show a bit of restraint. I'm sorry about them. They are just a bunch of my fans. They call themselves Team Yell and follow me around cheering for me. I think they uh, let it all go to their heads a bit. Come on, you lot. Back home with you now. They were just so caught up with wanting to support me. And all they need to te- all, And they all- All that they tend to get a bit- It's snuffy with other gym challengers. Sorry if that caused you any trouble. So you're a gym challenger too! Team Yell, was it? Pretty impressive that you already have a set of fans to call your own.
Adorable Pokemon. Hey, Butchim Challenger, you're not that bad. Okay, so she doesn't say anything new. Thanks for chasing away those those bothersome Team Yell creeps. Now I can finally I only talk to the front desk and get myself checked in. Guess we probably should head to the front desk and check in. Good evening and welcome to the Badoo Drop In. You must be one of the gym trainer, uh, Pokemon trainers entering the gym challenge. Yes. Yes, young Master Donnie. I can see the league has already booked a room for you. And if I might add, thank you for helping us out of that sticky situation with those bu with those hooligans earlier. I hope you have a pleasant stay here with us. Sleep well. The next morning. Morning! So this is it. Now my legend really begins. Watch out, Donnie! I, I'll beat you to Motorstroke Stadium! And with that, I think we'll end the episode off here. So in the next episode, we will go to the gym opening ceremony. If you enjoyed this episode, do like the video as it helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts on this episode and share the video so more people can discover my content and help the channel grow. And I'll see you all next time. Later.